Hi, I'm Rocco. I'm an editor here at Vice, and today we're going to go out to Westchester to check out the amazing Omega Wand. It's made out of granulated minerals and other fun stuff. Supposedly, it will stimulate your bioenergetic fields and do everything from cure muscle aches and back aches and kidney problems to transform a $5 glass of box wine into the tastiest vintage you've ever drank. That's wild. Yeah. I can't believe that. I think it's going to be something like a Botox party where people get wanded and they try to sell you the wand. So, I'm not sure what to expect, but it's going to be weird. So we're here now at Paul's house, who's going to be hosting the wanding party tonight. Hi, how you doing, Paul? He's also a representative of Omega Global, and he sells the wands, shows you how the wands work. He's going to wand me, he's going to wand everybody, and it's going to be awesome. So, so what, are you, what are you wanding right now? He's had shoulder pain, like when he throws a baseball. And this is the first time you've been wanded? Yeah, yeah. And what were your thoughts on it? What are you, what are you feeling right now? You know, general tingling, tinglingness, and a little bit. But subatomic stimulation of your yeah. cells in your body. Oh, just, I didn't expect you guys to be wanting right when we came in, so it was great. The wine's right there. Is it like a before and after? Grab a glass. Yes. Is this unwanted wine? One of the principles that the Omega Wand claims to operate on is something called zero-point energy. It's a very complicated quantum physics principle. If it actually uses zero-point energy, it's breaking several fundamental uh, concepts of physics, and it's a major breakthrough. Uh, yeah, I, I can seriously feel something, like for real. I'm a kind of a semi-pro, I guess, musician, and I also work in construction as a project manager installing wireless cell phone sites, which is kind of ironic considering this whole thing. I mean, the technology and the idea behind Omega basically is to strengthen your bioenergetic field. We're getting blasted by the cell tower down the street, by the cell phone in our pocket that we're putting up to our heads all the time, what they call electropollution, something that's new to mankind in the last, you know, 50 or so years. I got into it from a friend that I was working with in wireless who turned me on to some multi-level marketing programs. I asked them if they had anything else that was new that they wanted to turn me on. He told me about Omega and uh, got my wand a month later. It's stainless steel and inside from about here up there's a, a mixture of crystals and minerals that they, they put through a process called amized fusion. That's Omega's proprietary technology. Works on any food, any liquid. And what does it do to the food? Just It makes it taste better. It basically oxidizes it. I've tried it with wine, water, soda, fruit juice, and it basically kind of takes away that back end bitter taste. It makes it smooth, smooths it out. I want to try, I'm going to try the, the unwanted. <laughs> wine first here. It's definitely bitter. Yeah, you're right about the back end. It's smooth. It does taste it's smooth. smoother. That's a little weird. Do you feel zero point energized? It seems like people haven't really heard about it. Because if they had, then it would be like something that's bigger than it is. I mean, if this is truly healing people and making this wine better, I wonder why people, why it's not like this should be like peanut butter or something like better. It's like a hundred years ago if you said, I'm going to send a TV show invisibly through the air. People say, you're not going to do that because you can't do that. So that's like, to me, the wand is like, yeah, you're not actually making any physical contact, but there is so much out there that is unseen to the naked eye. Before I got the wand, I was pretty skeptical about it, and I was like, okay, you know, believe it when I see it. I've had miraculous experiences with this. And today, what's your pain level at? Zero to 10, 10 being gotta call 911, go to the hospital. I'd say about a six. Wow, so it's pretty high. So we're wanting Bobby Joe right now. Um, some lower back problems. Um, the nerve damage is caused by uh, a type of bone cancer I had, which is caused doing zircoma. Cancer? Yeah. They don't claim to cure or heal anything. But they say it's zero point field energy. It's accessing the zero point field energy in your body and enabling your body to kind of heal itself. I feel a heck of a lot better, I have to say. Like, How far down could you go before this? To here. 
And then to go any further, I would be Excruciating holding pain. myself going, okay, and stretch. And now you can touch your toes. Yeah. Now, I realize it's proprietary, but, like, where does this, like, have they, do they explain where they, where they discovered, is it AMIs, so you say it? AMIs AMI, diffusion. diffusion. technology. Yeah. It, that's pretty secretive, then, I would imagine. Like, that's the secret. They don't really tell you much about yeah, it. You know, yeah. I mean, you basically read as much as, as I know As much as you it. know. How many, how many have you sold, if you don't mind me asking? Um, I don't know, six. Six? Six or seven, yeah. And how, how much is, what's the, what's it retail for? It retails for 305. Are you familiar with, like, um, multi-level marketing at all and how so, it works. Somewhat. It's basically like, you know, a pyramid. Yeah. The guy that started selling this on January 1st, I'm five generations down from him. His name is Sam Adams. Okay. He's making like uh, $3,600 a day. Jesus. I, just Googling around, I actually found a company in Hong Kong called Quantum. The, their product was a pendant. It was actually banned by the government because it was found to have uranium and thorium in it. Has that ever worried you or anything, that it might contain anything radioactive? No, no. I mean, it's, they it, say it's, they're completely green. I wouldn't do my back, because that's where I do that pain, but... You should feel it, man. You should try the okay, back. Okay, let's try the back. Throw it the where are we at with time? It's about uh, three minutes. Maybe, maybe a little bit more than sort of counting. Yeah. counting. I'm trying to notice the difference. Give me a couple minutes. Let me give me a couple minutes for the powers of persuasion to wear out if there are any. <laughs> so we just got finished with the wanding party. Had some different outcomes. I didn't really feel too much. I didn't want to be impolite, so I didn't say it didn't work at all, which is kind of what I felt. When they were waving it over me that there was like a sort of magnet. I didn't feel anything like that. I didn't really feel anything. It's still um, very interesting, even the powers of persuasion, that it's just a piece of metal and there's nothing special that people can be convinced that they feel better, which obviously Paul is, and he's a very nice guy, and he seemed to genuinely believe that the wand was helping his health and his well-being and his, his mood. But what is it? I would really like to get my hands on a wand and find out what the fuck this thing is made of. So it's been a few weeks since the wanding party and we actually just got some copies of the embargo issue in today which features the wanding story. And uh, between the party and, and now, a couple things happened. Um, Paul let me borrow a wand for about a week and I wanted everything in sight, you know, my, myself, uh, my friends, apples, oranges, everything. And I didn't notice any differences. Before I returned it, I actually took it down to the New York Polytechnical Institute and had a Geiger counter put on it because I suspected that it might have some radioactivity. Fortunately, that wasn't the case. And we also put an RF meter on it and it wasn't emitting any kind of megahertz, which is something else that Paul and other Omega representatives have claimed. I did also speak with other Omega representatives after I couldn't get a hold of Sam Adams, who's the head distributor in North America, in returning my phone calls. The other guys I talked to had nothing but great things to say about the Omega wand and you know, claim that it's helped their health, their friends' health, and helped their pocketbooks a lot. The final person I talked to was renowned astrophysicist Bernard Haish. Hello? Uh, hello, Bernard? Yes, speaking. Hi, this is Rocco. Just with your professional background and expertise in the subject, could you summarize zero-point energy? Well, zero-point energy is a, is a quantum phenomenon. You can't ever take the last little bit of energy out of anything. That gives you an underlying sea of energy, which you can't see, but you can measure with atomic devices. As far as, uh, you know, Omega's claims that their AM wand can harness or focus this energy, what do you think of that? It's a complete scam. That the idea that, first of all, you'd be affected with a wand of some kind, and the idea that that would have any effect on the human body is also ridiculous. So it's, uh, it's ridiculous for two reasons. People either don't understand it, or they do, and they try to fool other people with it. Well, thank you so much, Bernard. You just debunked everybody in three minutes. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay, <laughs>